hope that you liked that little video of me taking you around with me shopping at my local Target. Now we're going to get into the haul portion of the video. I'm going to show you all the items that I actually purchased. And I have to say that I really tried to practice some self-discipline and some restraint, which we all know is very difficult to do at Target. I'll start with um, the things I got that are primarily for like Halloween. Let's start off with these cute pillows. This one of course says boo with glitter letters. The back of it is black. And I got this one that says happy Halloween with a friendly little spider here on the corner. In the back of it is orange. These were each $5. I think what I'm going to do with these is put these on the my rocking chairs on my front porch. I don't really know that they're intended to go outside, but I'll just have to be careful with these and take care of them and um, I guess not let them get rained on or get wet. And Or I could just spray some Scotch Guard on there and help protect them that way. Alright, next up I got this adorable little sign that says Trick or Treat with the little candy corns on there and then the polka dot ribbon at the top to hang it with. And what I really liked about this is that it's double sided. So you have trick or treat on one side and then it says, sorry, out of candy on the other side. This sign was $3. I think it's a really good value, especially because it's double sided. And I don't know about you, but I, I always hate if you ever run out of candy and you have another group of trick or treaters come up to your door and you have to turn them away. That just breaks my heart. So I always dread if that ever happens. We do run out of candy. I can just slip a sign and say, let the sign speak for me and I won't have to feel guilty and see their sad little faces when I would tell them that we're out. <laughs> All right, next I got these jumbo googly eyes. So there's a pack of two for $1. And I thought they'd just be really cute. Maybe like um, to put them on the window and kind of look like a big monster peeking out at you as you come up to the porch. So next up I got this caution tape that was a dollar. They had a few different kinds there. Um, but this one says enter at your own risk with a little web and a spider. I got this cute little lantern, little jack-o'-lantern face on there. So I have um, a little round table in between my rocking chairs on my front porch. And I thought this guy would be really cool to sit there on my table and maybe put a little votive flameless candle inside and have him flickering, especially on Halloween night be really neat to walk up and see him sitting there on the table as the trick-or-treaters come up and get their candy. Um, and that's all that I got that was more like Halloween stuff, but I will show you my daughter got this little cat art. It's like a little block of wood. Uh, it was $3 and she got this with her own money actually. I wasn't going to buy it, but she recently got money from the Tooth Fairy and this is what she decided to get with it was the little cat. She is a huge animal lover and she fell in love with this, especially with the glitter and the pretty colors. All right, so now we're going to get into the things that are primarily just fall decorations. And I have to go ahead and give a shout out to my friend here on YouTube, Carrie Murphy. Um, she recently also did a Target shop with me and Target haul video. So I'll link that below if you want to go check that out. Um, it's really good, really well done. And she inspired me to go and check out my local Target. Um, I was getting frustrated because they weren't stocking mine and I saw that hers did have a lot of cute items out so I made sure that I kept checking back and finally they had some items there so I when I watched her video I already had an idea of some of the things that I was looking for so shout out to Carrie thank you for inspiring me to go back to my Target and check again and get these items that I was um, that I fell in love with from your video. So we'll start off with this a little fall wording made out of wood. This was three dollars. The back of it is gold. I got this really adorable sign. It says hello fall again with that really pretty green color and kind of a more muted um, orange. And it has this string on the back to hang it up with. This was three dollars as well. So I'm not sure if we're going to actually hang it up or if I'm going to like prop it up somewhere but I just I love that. All right, so next up I got um, two bags actually of these string lights. It says that there are eight warm white LED lights or balls, I guess, in here. So each ball, it seems like, has a light inside of it. I got, so I got three pumpkins. They are foam pumpkins, the darker green 
has kind of a cool stem there. So they're made out of foam. It says tabletop pumpkin and they're each three dollars. I think this white one is my favorite. I love the shape of these types of pumpkins. All right, I got three of these cute little ceramic pumpkins. They have a gold stem and they were each three dollars. So again, the lighter and darker green. And then the orange. So I got this. This was not in the dollar section or the bullseyes playground, but I really liked it. It says thankful. It's a banner and it was six dollars. And I did have some really cute banners in the little dollar area, but I thought this one was a little bit better quality. Um, and it has, I guess, like little felt leaves that go on the side and then like a fabric. It's like a fabric um, banner, each little piece. And it has blues and browns. I thought it was really cute. And for $6, I mean, the banners in the dollar area, I think were like three. So for three more dollars, you get a little bit better quality. Next up, I got this really adorable gratitude tree. I love the idea of this. So you get the little like um, thin wooden pieces. You put your tree together and then you get like a whole bunch of the different colored leaves. So the idea is to give um, maybe a leaf or two or so to each family member and let them write out something that they're thankful for. And then you attach the leaves to the tree. So it's just kind of, you know, a, a visual representation that you can all see um, what you're thankful for, what you're thinking of. This will be our third year hosting Thanksgiving at our home and it's my husband's side of the family he has family here in Georgia but also three other states. So they all come in state and celebrate Thanksgiving with us which is a pretty big deal because we don't see most of these people except for like maybe once a year. So I even thought maybe leaving a couple of these leaves blank for some of those people so they can also add to our tree. Not just including only our family of five, but also including um, some of our extended family. Who... So I think the, this is the very last thing that I got at Target this trip are these adorable little pumpkins. I love these. Um, these were not in the dollar area, the Bullseye's Playground. These were, I guess, um, kind of near the registers and one of the little end cap, like the beginning of an aisle area. They had these, they had bigger pumpkins. They were all like this color scheme and had different designs or different sayings on there. But I love these. These This whole set, there's eight little pumpkins in here and it was $5. So it could easily be in the dollar area because, you know, items go up to $5 in that section. So it, there's like a white creamy pumpkin, like a coppery gold pumpkin, and then a silver one. And they all have the little glitter stems. So these are adorable. I don't really know yet where I'm going to put them, but I will find a place for them because I saw them and I loved them and I kind of wanted the big ones too, but decided just to stick with these for right now. So, okay guys, so that concludes my Target haul for this round. And I'm also wanting to check out some other stores like Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, maybe go to Walmart, Big Lots, places like that. So if you like these kind of videos with me taking you around the store a little bit and kind of shopping with me and then showing you the haul afterward. If you like this style, this type of video, you like this one and you want to see more, then please give this video a thumbs up and leave me a comment below and let me know that you'd like to see more. Let me know your favorite item from this haul that I had today. Um, I'm hoping to also do some home decor kind of tours. So if you'd like to see those as well, please let me know that. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day and I will see you all soon in my next video. Thank you. Bye.